This is tutorial 10-7 and this is how to edit 3D objects. Uh, we're going to start off where we left off and we're going to zoom into this area right here. And uh, the first thing we're going to do is uh, you're going to right click on here and choose your 3D editor. Once again you can come into toolbars and choose it from there. So whichever one's easier for you. Um, we're going to right click on buildings and we're going to go to data and we're going to export that data. And uh, the reason we're doing this is so we don't uh, corrupt the, the original data. So we're just going to name this 3D buildings. And we're going to click OK. We're going to add it. And we're going to turn off the original. Now you can see that it didn't show up. That's because we have to drape it. So we're just going to right click, go to properties, base height. We need it to float and we need it to extrude. That way it's 3D. Click OK. There we go. Now, one of the things they're going to have us do is go up here, click Start Editing. We're going to choose our 3D buildings. And they want us to use this right here, Edit Vertex Tool. We're going to click on this building right here, which they tell us is U.S. Steel Tower. And we're going to click on this button right here, which is the attributes. Now this gives us the attributes for that that one feature. As you can see, the height is a 700. They want us to change that to 1,000. Then click tab, or uh, hit tab on your computer. As you can see, it's thinking. What it will do is it will change the height of this from 700 to 1,000. Okay, and with that done, we can, they want us now to move a building, and they're going to have us move this building right here, and we're going to use this edit placement tool. We're going to click on the stadium here, we're going to click and drag it right here. You can ignore the that red circle on the bottom there, that is actually under the tin. And I, so you just click and drag and release when you want to place it. And I have it right here. So it takes use to getting to uh, move around 3D objects. So just practice with that. And uh, that's it for this tutorial. Uh, what they want you to do though is uh, stop editing. They want you to save your edits. So you just click yes. And whenever you add those, these, this stadium will no longer be here, but over here. And this building will no longer be 700, but 1,000.